Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So it's been a busy day yesterday for the release preview channel Insiders. And on the 11th of May, Microsoft also made a new original release update available for the Insiders in release preview, which will be our next optional bug fix update rolling out for version 21H2 uh, near the end of this month, May 2023. Now, the next update, um, optional update, will be KB5026436 and we'll bump the build up to build 22,000.2001. That's, of course, if you do decide to install the update. Now, um, the update does not have any new features. Unlike the Windows 11 22H2 update rolling out shortly, as I posted on earlier today, which brings the third wave of new features, also known as Moment 3, uh, the original release of Windows 11 unfortunately doesn't get any new features with the next optional update, but it does include plenty of improvements. Now, if you are interested and are still using Windows 11 21H2, just to go through some of these um, bug fixes that have rolled out. Um, the update addresses an issue that affects search indexer.exe. Apparently, it stopped working after some users signed out. Um, it also addresses an issue that affects narrator. Um, apparently, it does not announce text attributes correctly for words such as misspelled, deletion, change, and comment. And uh, it also addresses an issue that sends unexpected password expiration notices to users. And uh, um, the scheduled tasks, which is part of uh, the uh, maintenance features uh, built into Windows 10 and Windows 11, um, it also addresses an issue that affects scheduled tasks. The tasks fail when they use stored local user account credentials. And then uh, it also addresses an issue um, that affects access to tab settings for Internet Explorer mode. So um, Internet Explorer mode, obviously part of um, the Microsoft Edge browser. And there seems to be a lot of fixes rolling out for Internet Explorer mode um, in um, Windows 11 and also Windows 10. So Internet Explorer mode fix rolling out once again. And uh, what else? Um, the update addresses an issue this time that affects the event viewer, which is also another maintenance um, feature in the operating system. Uh, the issue limits the number of event sources that users who are not ad administrators can access. So that's another fix there for the maintenance side of Windows 11. And the update changes the support phone number for Microsoft India for Windows activation. And there are two printer fixes that have rolled out. The first is that it addresses an issue um, where uh, printers were failing to install if they were connected to Wi-Fi automatically. And the second is that it addresses a multifunction label printer issue. Um, it affects the installation of some of them. And then uh, two more to go. Um, the update addresses an issue that affects audio playback. Apparently, um, it was failing on some devices. And then the last one, there was a blue screen of death, which is also known as a stop error um, regarding the NTFS file system, which obviously um, is the file system used in Windows 10 and Windows 11. So um, that's just a quick overview of um, the next optional bug fix update rolling out for Windows 11, 21H2, KB5026436. And um, over and above those bug fixes I mentioned in this video, there are other bug fixes that will also be made available. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.